tonight, Sens head coach DJ Smith, actually a DJ, the bench boss, dropping a fire mixtape just before the holiday season. But first, our top story. The reviews are in for Dylan DeMello's Jingle All The Way reboot, and the critics agree, box office poison. The holiday feature spent just three days in theaters last year, and the disgraced director has since become a recluse, refusing any and all interview requests. requests. Right, Gord, that wraps up uh, two particularly dominant periods of hockey by the Ottawa Senators really are firing on all cylinders right now. No, absolutely, Dean. You know, it's a shame, though, that this kind of performance couldn't be uh, on display in that abysmal holiday disaster that was Dylan DeMello's Jingle All The Way reboot movie. Oh, yeah, you know, i got to be honest with you, Gord, that really was a steaming pile of crap. What did you sort out during those months away from the spotlight? Yeah, um, well, first off, I mean, it would, if I had the extra $300 million, I don't think we'd be here today. I think uh, I'd be doing a lot bigger movies and uh, with bigger budget, um, probably with some better casts. But uh, I went into hiding, went up to the cabin, and I just found uh, inspiration up there. And uh, I wrote probably 100 scripts, found five that I really liked, and uh, this is my road back to Hollywood.